Hey guys, what is happening? And welcome to the very first episode of the Animetal Cast podcast. Be sure to check the description box below and the end of this video for the link to Admin Todd's channel and show him all the love and support that you can give him. Also, be sure to check out my friends' channels, Michelle TL and Claudio Yarso, if you have not already done so. Also, guys, if you would like to be featured on the Animetal Cast, then be sure to check out my Patreon page and uh, check out the reward tiers to, for further details to see as how you can do so. Thanks for tuning in guys, I hope you enjoy the show and without further ado, let us begin. Hey guys, what is happening and welcome to the very first episode of the Animetal cast uh, with uh, myself, Animetal Viking, uh, my guests, uh, Michelle Tiel, Claudio Oyarso and our main guest, Edmund Todd, how are you guys doing today? Good. Woo! Doing good. Good, doing good. good. Yeah, yeah, it's good. Awesome, awesome. Uh, okay, guys, now, uh, as you guys uh, uh, will know from what I've been posting on all my pages and from the latest channel trailer, the purpose of this uh, podcast is to uh, promote the material of uh, YouTubers, artists, bands, so forth and so forth and um yeah just to create awareness and to help each other out and you know stick together as a community so that's basically the point of this so this is the very first episode and today we are interviewing the one and only admin todd who most of you should know from his extremely brutal amvs so <laughs> yeah <laughs> uh, that's what's going on today and uh, obviously uh the uh, the uh, my other friends Claudio and Michelle, who are going to be regulars on the Ota cast, are here as well. So yeah, uh, welcome to the show, guys. Thanks. Now, good to be sure. here. Thanks for having me. Sure. Okay. Um. So now, uh, this podcast it is semi formal, but only the first segment. So the rest of it, once the the first segment is out of the way. Uh, then, uh, yeah, then just basically every, uh, you can say whatever you want. We can talk about whatever we want. So just the first part is just so we get to know Edmund Todd a little bit better. And, uh, yeah, so um, that, that's basically the purpose of the first segment. Uh, Edmund Todd, are there any, you know, like um, any plugins you want to put there, like, you know, uh, channel link, uh, pages, anything like that you want to uh, shout out before we start? Uh, no, not really. Thank you, though. Okay, all right. Uh, but I'll leave the link to your channel in the description box and at the end of the podcast for everybody to click on and go check out. Okay, thanks. Okay, sure thing. All righty, so let's get the first segments over with. Um, okay, uh, Claudio, Michelle, um, if uh, uh, Edmund Todd says anything uh, you find interesting in his answers, you're also welcome to ask questions. I'm not here to hog the first segment. This is Ooh, a group oh boy. Episode. I got, I got hundreds <laughs> of questions. I I love your channel, man. I really do. Oh, thanks. It's fantastic. <laughs> I do animating too. I got to ask, y you seem to pop up those videos so fast. It takes me a month to do like lip syncing and stuff. Do you have like uh, a, a secret? Well, the, the, <laughs> the, my latest channel was, I just uploaded all the videos I had saved. That was a period of over, I think, three or four years. So. Okay, now I get it. I'm thinking, yeah. oh, this dude's a genius. He just freaking makes <laughs> no, the video so no. fast. 20 to 80 hours is my uh, average for an AMV. Yeah. Wow. And obviously, Claudio's reacted to a bunch of your stuff before, Admin Todd. Yeah, I've, I've seen a few. I've seen, I, I think I've seen two. Uh, well, I watched many of them. Uh, I just reacted to two that you actually suggested, Russell, uh, yeah. a while yeah. back. And it's really, I, I was like in the, under the impression that, um, that the channel was shut down. And that's why we have a bunch of, uh, videos uploaded like within the last few months. Yes. Because there's so much content here. It's insane. Yes, that is right. Uh, I have, I've actually had my channel shut down twice now. So. Twice. That's why I'm a little bit lax a days ago about, you know, my account and everything. So, yeah. But are you getting it back, though? No, um, it was a Japanese company that uh, filed the complaints um, three at a time, and uh, I had no way of contacting them. So, oh. and that's how you get it removed. So, I just kind of took the hit and went with it. So, oh, man, that sucks. That's a shame. Was, 
Was this by any chance uh, for your countdown videos, like your top 10 series? Yes, it was my rank videos, which I loved making so much. Um, unfortunately, the, my editing style for them has just caused so many copyright issues. So, uh, Yes, yes. Uh, that, that's a, that is a pain because um, actually what happened is one of my reviews uh, got blocked and uh, so forth. And then um, Michelle actually helped me get them removed. So... Uh, but I understand what you're saying. Um, there's a whole uh, problem with using footage of a certain length and stuff. That's why uh, when uh, I, I found out uh, uh, that your channel is back, I suggested that you check out Digibro's How to Get Fast Content ID videos. So I hope that helps if you want to uh, carry on with the countdown videos in the future. Yeah, no, I, I decided to give up on ranked videos, unfortunately. So I'll just be cranking out an AMV every now and then, unfortunately. So... Oh, it's all good. It's all good. Everyone loves your AMVs here. Yeah, so, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Um, basically, now uh, what I want to ask you, uh, Admin Todd, is uh, what made you decide to start making YouTube videos? Uh, was, uh, was it like, uh, were you just watching other AMV channels and were inspired to do it? Or were you just like, I just want to make stuff and just put it out? <laughs> That's a good question. Um I actually started out watching anime on YouTube back uh, 10, 12 years ago when YouTube started out. And um, I saw AMVs on there. I used to watch an AMV before I buy an anime to, to get a feel for the animation and if I'd like it. So yeah. that's what decided to, to get me into AMVs. And I have I consider myself to be very knowledgeable on anime, so I did rank videos. So that's mm. where that came from. And I just kind of did both. It was fun. So Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. Uh, any, uh, and, uh, sorry. Yeah. Um, and are there any, uh, you know, particular channels or YouTubers that uh, uh, inspired you to, to start what you were doing? Like, were there any good ones back in the day? Um, not any rank videos, but, uh, there was one AMV that stuck with me. I, I don't know the name cause it was a long time ago, but I remember watching it. It was, um, a Rooney Kenshin, the, um, uh, the OVA. Oh, yes. oh yeah. Okay. And it was not that was um, the song was Slipknot. Um, I don't oh, remember nice. the name of the song, but it really <laughs> stuck with me. I'm like, that was a really good AMV, and I wanted to kind of replicate what that person uh, made for me. Uh, the song is The Nameless. Oh yes, yes, oh yes. That's might even be able to find it right now. Give you guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sometimes it's hard to find old AMVs. I've sometimes been searching for stuff I watched when I was like in sixth grade and I still can't find that shit. It's all been deleted or... I yeah, don't know, exactly. Yeah. Uh, good old days with the old AMVs. Awkward silence. <laughs> <laughs> I still have some of my really old ones still <laughs> saved because somebody else saved them, you know? Like the... Uh, I got... Uh, I think it's Trigun and, um, and Cowboy Bebop over a donut you ever seen that one it's like them two splurged together no not no really. not, it's not really me. funny they're chasing down vash and they try to catch him using donuts whoever made it <laughs> is a genius because they seriously <laughs> they spliced it together so it's the two of them together in one amv yeah oh nice yeah. yeah it's crazy when people can edit uh totally separate footage together make it look like it's part of the same thing like I, I, my editing skills are absolute shit. Uh, because when I came across Edmund Todd's channel, uh, re he really got me into trying to make my own heavy AMVs. But I suck terribly. Like I remember the first <laughs> one I, <laughs> the first one I tried to make was um, uh, using heavy music. Was uh, it was one using one of Oceano's songs. And <laughs> it's so out of time with everything, with only the odd scene timing with the breakdown here and there. But uh, yeah, I just sucked at it. So I've pretty much been sticking only to like um, medium pace to slower songs and so forth. So it can I think get really lot... intense, man. You get really yeah. intense. Yeah, yeah. That Infant Annihilator one though, that drummy. Oh my gosh! I, don't I just know wish I had that. rendered it in better quality back then. I got a lot better um, with quick picking video quality, but uh, back then it just it just only my original video has the proper rendering quality, but the YouTube quality just sucks. Uh, yeah, YouTube tends to do that sometimes. In yeah, videos. it's annoying as hell. Oh gosh. But the lip syncing too, like, I do not know how you do that. It's, it's, I know. Uh, 
I know I, you're, you're a master at it. Holy crap. Thanks. Yeah. Thanks. There was one guy, um, Opie something. He was a college <laughs> student. He took off real big with his channel. I think he got like a couple hundred thousand subs and he was a big lip syncer and Tony Envy winner. And I still thought my lip syncing was better than his, but <laughs> yeah, whatever. Yeah, I know. Uh, I actually watched a few videos of that guy, the Opie dude. He's he had good. a bunch. He's yeah, he's really good. He's really. He did a bunch of this. Uh, I I think he used to do like this misheard lyrics kind of kind of videos. Uh, you know, with different different lyrics, uh, up on top songs and stuff like that, like compilations. Listening to like misheard uh, words and stuff like that from Japanese, which was pretty funny. I think he did a few of those. Uh, laugh my ass off watching them. Yeah, he, he's, he's really good. <laughs> yeah, when you get the li- lip sync on, it's really good. I think you did. I think you did the one with the uh, Detroit Metal City. That shit was fucking hilarious. I thought that that was so much <laughs> fun back, watching yeah, the the sequence with the drummer and the song. It's uh, it fits together so perfectly. It's awesome. It's really yeah. good job. Unfortunately, it's just like such a niche audience, you know, with the kind of music I like to use. But you know, yeah, I was like, no, whatever. But- Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's it's awesome. It's so it's so much fun just to watch it. So it's it's yeah. good. But even his channel updates have the lip syncing. You did one with Thundercats, and that was hilarious. I'm like, even his channel updates have <laughs> the, <laughs> the uh-huh, lip syncing yeah. and everything put together. I'm like, damn. Yeah, we we tried actually to to start something off with our little dub series, but it didn't go anywhere. So we'll just be producing videos every now and then for that one as well. Are you referring to uh, the uh, your friend's channel with the with the um, par- abridged stuff? Yeah, That's- so good it hurts. Um, yeah, we made uh, several videos and then it just just stagnated, unfortunately. So we'll oh, see where it actually- goes. I actually enjoyed them. I actually checked out a whole bunch of them the other day. I really enjoyed the um, the one uh, where where one of your friends was uh, imitating uh, Christopher Lee with um, uh, what's it um, Saruman. They yeah, yeah, Dub Session. I actually like that one too. I don't, I don't like his humor, but um, I do enjoy working on stuff like that. Yeah, and the other one that you guys did with the three high school um, uh, boys and the <laughs> yeah, and the, yeah, but the, the, with the Gordon Ramsay and uh, Rachel Ray. That that was that was pretty funny. So uh, I really enjoyed that. No, you, you guys have a lot of potential on that channel. So I'd say don't give up on that one. That one's actually really funny. I actually enjoyed a lot of those videos. Yeah, we'll, we'll definitely keep making videos. just not like a constant two videos a week kind of thing, just every now yeah. and then. So. Yeah, and see where it goes. Yeah, yeah that, that's, exactly. That's, that's well, making awesome. that kind of content is hard, man. I know. I know it's hard. Oh, crap. I couldn't do two videos a week doing that. <laughs> I couldn't do it. No, my that one animation that I made took me a month. To make oh it yeah, you animated. I can't imagine. I'm sure it takes a long time. Yeah. Which animation are you referring to specifically, Michelle? The mosquito. It took me a whole oh, month that, to make that. Yeah. A month. A month. Oh. Yeah. Damn. Oh. <laughs> and that doesn't I even really have lip syncing in it, and I didn't even do lip syncing. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like to like have the animation and do lip syncing <laughs> would be a nightmare. You wouldn't see it for like three, four months, maybe. <laughs> yeah, because I uh, know that other one you animated, the one where you were uh, ranting the uh, about the game testers for, yeah. for when you were making your games, that that was quite a long rant, and yeah. it was animated fully, so <laughs> yeah, no, that time. was awesome. Yeah, but I didn't lip, lip sync that either, because like I said, you know, to take the time to, you know, match up the sounds to, you know, mouth movements and everything, that takes so much time, so I have so much respect for you, Admin Todd. <laughs> the sounds are they're quite a lot, aren't they? They're, mm-hmm. they're, they're painful. <laughs> so, but yeah. uh, how do you how do you go about it when you do like this uh, this the sync up? I mean, you, you like what type of uh, software do you use to to uh, to to Sony, do your AMVs? Sony Vegas Pro. I've been using it for oh, six okay. or seven years, so. Oh, all right. I have a very specific editing style that I go through, and it, it works. It's very quick, a very mm-hmm. quick style that I've uh, tuned. So. Okay. Yeah, but it looks awesome. fucking pro, so it's... it's Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's what I That's, use, too, but it always crashes on me, or it always does something. It always does something. <laughs> 
to me. Yeah, you gotta get on the video codex and hope you have everything right. You gotta get the good, a good rig, you know, to handle handle it. And yeah. Convert the, the the video footage properly, and it's you know just stuff you learn over time. Yeah, yeah I've been I've been using uh for my AMVs and even my regular videos. I have been using a uh, video pad uh, for quite some time. But uh, that new channel trailer I actually made I was the first time using uh, Vegas Pro, and I can tell you I was confused with that thing. So oh, yeah. <laughs> it's once yeah. you master it, it's it's a beast of a software, very powerful. Mm. Yeah, because um, how I used to make my MVs before was I I would take uh, the odd clip like that I wanted, but then I'd take clips from uh, a lot of other people's AMVs. And if I thought that it matched up with whatever particular song that I wanted to use, I'd just use it in there and it would either fail or it would pass with the, with the motion and the timing. So, uh, but yeah, the uh, video pad was very simple to use, but, uh, it doesn't have the greatest transitions. Like some of the transitions would just lag and like jump and everything. It was, it was just a pain. So you had to use jump cuts a lot and everything. Mm-hmm again <laughs> <laughs> i'm all a pain in the ass until you get it done yeah. and then you can look at it and say yes i made this i did yeah. this <laughs> you know you know what i think i think i think like the lag russell i think that, that i think it's about the hardware I, I, because yeah. I, I was um i was in a shitty computer before and i was using like um oh man i don't even remember this uh software a power di- director uh, 13 it's it's a pretty simple kind of basic uh hardware uh, not software and then i changed my i i bought a new computer and i upgraded to uh um uh, premiere pro and it works fine i mean it's, it's so fucking fast it works really really good yeah, it's a bit expensive, you know, with the thing, but it's still it's pretty good. Uh, it works flawlessly. Never had any problems with it. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. You mean tell yeah. me? Are are you using um, Adobe Premiere yeah. Pro? Yeah. Holy shit, man! Don't you have to pay for that like every year? No, I have like a monthly. <laughs> yeah, I have to pay for it. Sure, I have like the, they, they they use this uh, thing uh, called. Um, uh, creative cloud adobe creative cloud and with that you can get like a like a like a pack type type deal so i have photoshop and uh um and and premiere and stuff like that so yeah yeah but i know it's not a one time fee it's like a no continuous a, a month, fee for that yeah like, it's like a month do that. Of, no, really do well i don't know it works for me i mean it, you know what I, it's like it, for me, at least, it's not it's not really about the money. It's more like I, I want it to work and I don't want to have to deal with the bullshit of having something that's either lagging or yeah. doesn't work properly. It just <laughs> I rather pay yeah. for it. Yeah. Stuff, yeah. I rather just just pay a little fee and, and you know, it, done with this. yeah, yeah. So that, that's kind of how I think in a way. Yeah. Makes but, yeah. sense. OK, I have another question for Edmund Todd. Um, now, uh, when you upload your videos, I take it that uh, the songs that you use uh, for your videos are obviously claimed by the record labels that own the bands, correct? Yes. Most cases, yes. Yeah. Okay. Um, now, uh, in light of that, um, the ones that uh, you can monetize, so I'm assuming there are a few of them, um, how has the uh, ad crisis affected you in any way? Have, were you earning any money before on your old channel? Uh, due to, uh, some principles I have, I've never, uh, attempted to monetize any of my videos I've made. Oh, okay. Ooh, That's wow. fine. That's really cool of you. <laughs> I don't know if it's cool. <laughs> no, I could have made some money, but. Uh, all that work, all that hard work and you, and you don't make people watch, you know, ads and get it monetized. Totally jet, man. That's awesome. 